here in New Jersey, um, there is only 24 lockers. Um, we have more players than that, and uh, so I approached uh, Gino the day before and said, listen, I know you're not playing, so is it okay if I put you in a chair for the day? And he told me he didn't care because he knew he wasn't playing. So I went and found the nicest chair <laughs> possible, and we put his gear up, and uh, the team came in, and Phil Kessel saw it right away, and he just kind of started giving it to me. I can't believe you put Gino in a chair, and uh, everyone was laughing, and, and so... Uh, kind of escalated a little bit and uh, all in fun obviously and then uh, today was a little bit of a just a little payback to Phil to let him know that you know we wanted to put him in a very nice stall here at the practice rink so we kind of gathered up his stuff and some things that uh, you know we thought he needed for practice today and uh, set his stall up. It's a quick response and all right the next day you, <laughs> you sit laughing and I respect uh, a good prank, but that takes a lot of work, you know, a lot of time to do, and um, that's well done, yeah. Cans of Coca-Cola and coffee, what was missing? Uh, hot dogs, I mean. <laughs> I love hot dogs too, you know, it's like... Uh, <laughs> you just don't have them in your locker. Then I help me, you know, and uh, he's a funny guy, you know, he's uh, uh, it's my good friend here, you know, it's like an uh, amazing player, amazing guy. Everybody likes it, it's all in good fun, and... Uh, you know, and Phil always seems to be in, in the center of all that. So uh, I think it's I think it's really I think it's really good stuff, and uh, I think that's just an indication of of the type of chemistry we have in our locker room.